Hello friends, I hope you are well. Got some some tanks in their garage today. It's kind of a nice day out. And uh, yeah. So what do we have? We have two levels of nomads and three levels of lunatics. Um, I chose to go, ooh, that kind of caught on there a little bit funny, huh? I chose to go with Nomads first in order to get the Growl, or, or sorry, in order to get the Vector and um, the Race Wheels and the Growl I bought for 40 coins, and now I have crafted another one while I was over at Lunatics, and I just got level 3 of Lunatics, and I'm going to fuse them in the Ravens event, and then we're going to rebuild the car because we're going to have some more tonnage to work with. Uh, so that's fun. I also fused the radiator uh, in the event. I had crafted two of those as, and I crafted a big a big G as uh, that was why I took lunatics after two levels uh, of nomads. So overall, this is a pretty tough uh, card. So how do we have it constructed? So all right, first thing we'll do we'll take the paint off don't have much in the way of paint yet and we're gonna see what we have here so we've got all the canvas roofs around the edge uh, these four all the large four by four parts that we have from uh, lunatics and from nomads so basically sorted everything by durability and use that stuff first and it's all this is just a whale back we just got another one of those and it's all uh, strung out here on these buggy floors. So we've got two buggy floors and more buggy floors going across. You'll just have to do what you can with what you got. And we've got some engineer parts, these van windows, just for a little bit of protection, brazier. This is a light build after all. And most of our uh, durability is over the front wheels and that's attached directly to the frame. Um, so actually it's just attached directly to the gun mount because I, I could put something else in there to attach it but the gun mounts you can hardly ever lose them of course you got your hatchets up here on the gun mount whatever bumpers you may have here off-road bumpers but that key is getting things to hit there in front before they get to your weapons the side ones are a little bit more vulnerable with the them in this configuration but i kind of like the look of them so we can kind of mess around with that a little bit when we do the rebuild Okay, so then you've got your gun mounts on the front on our lightweight frames, and we've got a ball bar underneath. That's one of the stronger bumpers you get for having a few levels of lunatics. Uh, we crafted these race wheels, and we've got one non-steering in the middle and steering on either end. Uh, blue wheels wouldn't be worth fusing, although I wouldn't have mind fusing some of those uh, teal wheels, the APC wheels, but... Um, I don't think we're going to be able to afford those by the time we get them. So, again, same configuration on both sides. Just stuck a radar on there. Four vectors. Got all of our buggy floors up here. And you could mount these a lot of different ways. Just getting them up high there like that. And then down at the bottom, we have one fused R2 chill, which we made as part of the Raven Fusion. So, a 71% effect instead of because of the additional 42 percent durability boost and then we have also uh decided to purchase rather than um rather than join scavengers yet because we we've got this p1u charge so that using our 40 coins a day to kind of wisely here um to build up a few parts over a little while um and then at the back you've got the one by eight frame you know, a couple of two by four frames. You have to use lightweight ones here. Just trying to keep everything as strong as I can. Got the radio underneath, the growl, a couple more frames. So kind of basic there. Um, now let's see if this Raven's Path thing is available here. We've disassembled our car in order to get the cab to appear. And uh, I guess probably scroll past it. There we go. Okay, we have everything we need. So this this is gonna give you minus 17% mass, delay before self-destruction minus 20%, and weight limit 10%, which is 
good that's uh, 600 kilograms worth of weight you can carry so that's a good fusion not too expensive I've been playing some of the uh, Raven adventures I had some talons Talers, and uh, so I'm gonna craft this and there we go all right I'm gonna use it okay so now I don't know why I put you in the garage though. that seems like a bug okay so this is the best wheels we have that's probably I'm gonna look and see what frames what frames do we have? So you can sort this by uh, by durability. And so we have one of these lightweight frames and some of these here. I think we'd like to be four wide. So we'll probably use these lightweight frames again. And our grout. So you're going to put one down. It's kind of annoying to read that sometimes because put it down somewhere and then you can kind of start moving it around from there uh, okay oh there we go go more forward than that so let's see here And that generator is going to go forward if that's what we do. But I think I'll protect the front a little more now with another frame. And do we have we have these two by six frames now, so those will work for the back. So we're going to get a lot more, a lot more armor on this thing because we're using these light frames, and they're still pretty strong. This one still has 210 durability, and it's only your back wheel, right? <laughs> that's why you have six wheels. Uh, you just get you start going faster at that point, right? So, okay. Now we want to put. We don't have very much in the way of parts. With the big G is really nice to have. Um, we kind of jumped a step here and went straight to the P1U charge, which you can basically use to end game. I don't. I, the Apollo is really nice, but it does definitely raises your power score a lot. So allows different configurations, which is fun. But anyway. So we'll just put a block in the back, and no, that probably is a pretty good wheel configuration. So we need some more frames out front, I guess. Got this one, 420 durability. Maybe we can narrow it in at the front slightly, and then gun mounts. not successfully doing geometry right now excuse me all right so we know we have some spikes right not very much but we'll get blade wings soon this trick this plow this is a really strong part kind of wedgy people hate that but you know it works this get up high to protect your stabby bits yeah, I don't really want to hit that it's very rammy hmm your bumper catches looking but actually would be pretty effective at keeping those front wheels on okay we've got one bumper spike for the back it's a little bit vulnerable but okay so got these whale backs we've got one we've got fenders those fenders on. These could actually be attached to the 
the car itself. Wonder how quick till this thing over goes overweight. Might need to add an engine to this. Wonder I wonder if I can afford a hardcore. What do you think, Harry the dog? Want a hardcore? It's a pretty good engine. Let's see here. Got 132 coins. What's a hardcore go for? Hardcore. 133. To craft it, we need to do. Oh, it's lunatics. I could craft it. Ooh. Need to craft that. That's engineers. That's easy to craft. And I digress. Probably a false savings, probably it was cheaper to buy it, but it makes you feel like you've done something when you craft something. Kind of fun. I'm gonna get grind in here, but it's uh, a challenge. Alright, so let's see. What else do we have? I'll put a radio on it. Get into there. And put the radar on before we use up all our energy. And let's not need an ammo pack. Oh, we don't have very many modules. Alright, vector. So what do we have buggy floor wise? These two. damper in our radar plan, but it's not that important, so. It's right in the front, first thing gets shot off. Radars are pretty good armor, actually. It's kind of funny. Oh, I should pull up the Twitch chat. Pardon me. Hello, Twitch friends. Yeah, let me know if you have any ideas. Okay, so we're putting the guns up here. This could... Uh, I can't spread out because of the way the wheels are, but that's okay. Um, Bucky floor... A couple of these. I seem to remember we're a little short. So you can also use radiator grill. It just doesn't have connections on the other... Part, but you can do this to make it connect on the front or the back. Which I think it's better, probably back. And we have these fryers, so kind of on the back somewhere. See, but good, right? Via panels, rear door, go. And let's see here, whale backs. roofs out here. Is it roofs like hooves.
that's cool. Do that over here too. These whale backs are just a little funny. Mm, okay. That's not where it goes. How about there? That's more right. Starting to run out of parts here. We'll sort by power score. Ignore these APC parts. Ill gotten gains, I say. No, we're just not working with those parts right now. Okay, minivan sideboards. See how much durability we still have? We can interlace some of these, maybe. Can't quite span the whole gap. That's too bad. I don't know. That might be good. Just add a little bit of armor out there on the wings. And better put the guns on. We might not we might actually be out of tonnage. Minor things. Oh, parts limit too. Okay, well. I'm gonna lose these two of those at least okay not too far still over Okay, only 13 over, so. It's a lot of protection up there in the front. But, this has got to not go right there. I'm just kind of wanting to use all of my strongest parts, but not using one whale box, not that big of a deal. Don't really want people behind you too much anyway. I think we're in parts of it anyway, so. But I will at least see if I can fill in these gaps here. Yeah. It's not bad, just one extra little piece. Alright. So it was about 13 pounds, 13 kilograms left. All right, this is kind of a chunky growl here. I'm gonna go in uh, bromine. Oh, that is just terrible with the red. Blue is terrible with the red too. That's sandstorm. It's not bad. I'll go rough sand though. Probably someone would do a fancier paint job than that. I don't know if we have to do it. Have any decor? Oh, yeah, not much. That's okay. I have a sticker. Okay. All 
All right, and just for you folks, I'm gonna put it up in the exhibition. Let's see, what do we? How many do we have? Don't have any. Level three, level four. We got level seven. The growl with two chords. I think we better better lose this one. Send you. Lunatics to refuse. Hopefully you're having fun with the event. All right, well, let's better, well, you know what? Really should test drive. I'll test drive just for a second, make sure. Out of the tonnage, pretty chunky. Fire's a long time. That fuse really does help on that. Radiator. I mean, until you can get a, some seals, it's nice. It's a big difference over just the stuff. Guns can fire a long time. Alright. I don't know if I'm going to get much else in this Raven's Path. Probably makes more sense to grind for scrap. I've been buying for scrap lately. Top stand is falling over. I'm reaching for water. I hear the dogs asleep at my feet. Good job. So professional. Mm -hmm. It's professionally laying here. All right. So what's next? Ooh, crafting that. I want to craft a hardcore engine. So what else do I need? I need to make this booster. Oh boy. In order to craft that, you need to be a lunatic. Hmm. Decide. I get four. I got four. My forty coins today. Gonna be nice. What other fusions do they have? Well, fusions are not usually good at low level, but honestly, I think this growl is totally worth it, and the the chill, the R2 chill, is totally worth it. So, yeah, APC wheels. Can't craft those yet. Those are good. Race wheels are fine though. These just have blast resistance and a little less power draw. A little, they're a little better. Auto cannon, fuse. Those are good at low levels. Rapiers. Yeah, that was a good. That was a good fuse. Hulks are really cool at low levels. I like them very much. They will blast the heck off of you. Vectors are great. I don't think I'd fuse vectors though. Hulks maybe because they have such a high durability. But vectors, you gotta replace them once you can with sign to zero. Actually really tacklers is kind of the way to go. But that's all expensive, so I'm gonna bounce back and forth between notepads and lunatics to get the parts we need lighter. Lighter, faster, better machine guns kind of build path. Big thing with cross out is if you try to do everything all at once, you're not going to do any of it well. So if you spend you know, like half of the build, turn. Oh boy. Oh boy. How close are you? Okay, how faster are you? Oh boy, that's some big boys there. We have two machine guns left. See, they're like wet noodles. Although I did take a lot of fire there. Well, pay attention to try to actually strip, strip some weapons here. Oh, 
Uh oh. Got my weapons. Come on now. Gotta ram into you. That's all I want to do. Take the wheel here. Smash you up there. Don't don't you block, block your friends here. But can't maneuver or you're gonna press to get us. Oh, I went head on. Turned in too early. That's okay, that was a good game. People got grenade launchers and stuff. It's crazy. Okay, like that. Hey, new level. Engineers, 13. Okay. Let's go back. Oh, nice. Another van door. Rear door. Can I put that on instead? Bigger, stronger part. Maybe I'm going to put them out here. not enough weight. I'm going to have to lose something to do that. So, you know what? Just rebuilt it. Let's keep playing. All right. So, next faction I need. Can I craft the hardcore? It's nothing. I get to get that. Okay. All right. Eventually, we're going to get signed to zero, so we've got to go back to nomads. I don't want to change back and back. Probably not ready to do sign of zeros yet, anyway. So, that would be something worth fusing. I think those are pretty great. get some scrap metal. this ride. It's nice. Pretty tough. Smashy smash. Take a hit in the face. See? See, that's the generator didn't even blow. That's the difference between the gas gen and the P1U charge. And you can still kind of drive and steer. The tank is upside down, so you can go around back and just shoot it in the cap. Shoot the frames off. This range. Guns don't overheat very fast. So, yeah, it's taking a while to spawn, but not too bad. So what's the power score here? 5100. Yeah, it's a pretty good balance. It's okay, Harry.
for other players. We're not stuck somewhere. to the chat is lost. Return to the garage. Boy, that was a bummer. Come on, people. Need this faction for a little while. It's definitely hardcore is better than the Dunhorse. The Dunhorse, the Dunhorse takes a one energy, where the hardcore does not. Hardcore is just a something one step below a hot red. Doesn't have the reload perk, but still awesome. Maxwell, that's a really nice radar to get if you want to have active radar early in the game. And the Storm Auto Cannon, those are nice. Those will serve you well in the game. But I definitely like the P when you charge better than. P1 charge better than the Ampere because the Ampere only has 30 durability. Hawk drones can work well. Getting stealth is nice. Reason to get into nomads. Scavengers. Twin wheels, you know, lots of cannons. The Hulk is pretty sweet. The P1 charge. See, that has. 164 durability. Saw that hanging on the front. Taking a long time to spawn, folks. We may have to end the stream a little early if we can't get some action going for you. That's okay. Point is, it's fun to rebuild your car every time you go up a level. <laughs> some people don't do that, but every time I get new parts, I want to do it better. Better, better. Refine. And this is working pretty cool. And we are going to craft some things while we're waiting to spawn. There's always something to do. All right because then next we'll craft this thing and uh, then we'll be able to start our hardcore which takes two hours and it takes 100 plastic but we might use our coins to buy some plastic so we'll see how much we can afford keeps you coming back for your daily 40 coins does make it possible to get through this. It's really hard to without you know, make very much progress very fast. Okay. Let's go help our bot friends. We need to get in super, super close with machine guns. Guns are awesome. Ba -da -ba -da -ba -da -ba -da. All right. So I haven't been hindered by these big bumper things yet. It's very chunky. 
And I can still go. Oh, there we go. Shoot me. Find me. Oh boy, running into a rock. There we go. get some of the daily challenges done they want you to use a shotgun they're trying to you know the thing is is that on the if you just got you're not following the shotgun you don't always need to have the best shotgun ever um, you can just do a really small Lupara build on a sprinter or something some you know four wheels four four race wheels would be great and just go bang it out in a patrol don't don't have to buy every every shotgun along that list as you go up in levels to keep your challenges going. It's not worth it. They're only you get the, they're like only twenty scrap or something. You don't get much for doing them. So they're fun to do. It's fun to use different weapons sometimes, but you don't always have to have the best of all of the different types of weapons at once. You have kind of like one main. You're progressing to keep that weapon improving, and then kind of you can augment that with other things. So. Yeah. So yeah, well we'll see how it all goes. This is waiting for other players. Getting stuck again. Oh. Sometimes you can spawn back in. Yeah. Return to garage. Okay. Alright, well, we'll end on that last one since it obviously uh, really doesn't like us. And as always, I'll take you on the test drive to get a couple of screenshots. And uh, I do appreciate you watching and your notes and comments. It's fun think that uh, this is really helpful for me to do these streams, so I do appreciate you checking them out, and I think that if you can help just to one or two new players, that's great. Uh, that's what I'm going to do. So, I'm going to look at my lighting angle here, so Alt-Z to hide the overlay, and then, and then just hold down Alt to keep your, your gun straight while you turn the camera around. I'll look for some angles that and hitting Alt F1. Do like machine guns. background that much. That's better. Thanks for watching, folks.